Hello and welcome. Day 25, episode 25 of my 90 plus day series. I'm dressed like this on purpose. It gives you the impression that I'm going to the sea, which I am. But I will speak about something related to the sea, sand, although I will not be in the sand myself. In a couple of days it's my birthday and I'm meeting my lovely parents today and uh, I'm going to spend some time together because I'm pretty busy with the stuff that's happening in the coming two weeks of my life and therefore I chose a topic today which is a particular one. In, in Malta, for the local people, the, the phrase isn't that, isn't that uh, common, but if you research the meaning of the phrase a line in the sand when you make a line in the sand it's like i'm i'm done you know in, in maltese for for maltese speaking people it's called issa da sec yo manerjash things like that sandra Pach, welcome kevin good morning so what is your line in the sand moment in a way you could call it a a defining moment a non going back moment Okay, now yes, of course, for those people who are a bit on the skeptical side, they say, but sand, like, you know, it can flow back in with the wind and stuff, but that's not the point. The point is, uh, psychologically, humankind is understands uh, the sand as being something where you, you put memories, you know, like beautiful drawings and, and people's loving um, uh, relationships are all related to walks on the sand, you know, like picnics or stuff like that happening on in that in that environment in that atmosphere so when we say a line in the sand moment it's like a defining moment what could be your defining moment you might want to think about this you might want to reflect about this for me i have had a couple and so and what the more i thought about today's topic and like what i'm going to be saying and sharing with you here um, more ideas came to mind, more moments came to mind, but the one I, which I want to focus on today is something that happened around a year and a half ago. Around that time, I drew a line in the sand. No more, hi Anna Maria Collison, no more of a certain something, and that something was no more pressure trying to get better financially, let me put it this way, okay, no more pressure, I knew, I understood from all of my readings and all the stuff, it does take time, it does take effort, it does take energy, it does take resources, and one has to be prepared here and here, the heart, to do that, to invest the time to improve. In any aspect of life, in, a, in any aspect of life, hi Anton, in any, any aspect of life really, but this one is a, is a particular one. So a year and a half ago, I drew a line in the sand and my attitude shifted. And I said, okay, that's it. I'm open to the idea of taking the time that is required to improve like permanently, once and for all. And hi Frank. Thank you for your signature turned, my signature turned picture by you. Gustavo, hello. So yes, I drew that line and I opened up myself and I said, okay, line in the sand moment, never again will I try to rush this idea. Nothing happened for a number of days and weeks. I'm not sure if it might have been months as well. Um, but at one point in time, I met, I, I, I stumbled across a course and I will speak about the course later on because the most important thing is what that course led me to. And what that course led me to is going to be posted down here for anyone who would like to really permanently start the process of improving one's financial landscape. It, I warn you, it's not an easy journey. It's simple to some extent. It's not easy. It takes a lot of time, energy, money, resources, okay, or combinations of hi Rachel. I'm hoping to say hi to everyone whom who pops up on my lives. If I don't, please do not be offended. I say hi to everybody anyway, and I really appreciate you for watching and I appreciate you for sharing these messages. 
So yes, I will post below and you can actually see for yourself the, the basics, Rafael, Janna, the basics of what it takes to to start the process. A year and a half, a bit less actually, because of course I started the process, I encountered something else, which is this one below, um, and yeah, and I started the process, and it's about, it's about just a year and a bit after. I am so fortunate, I feel so blessed to be having this education that I'm receiving, and through this education I started correcting a lot of like badly learned practices in many areas of my life not not to say the least um, the way I was trying to approach people and uh, let's put it this way marketing in fact this actual series here is a my kindergarten in video marketing as I like to call it okay so line in the sand moment never I never go back beyond that from this point it's only forward you may want to think of your own line on the sand moment and I do have a couple of others that now that I'm thinking about it I confirm that I will be doing videos about them as well they, they happened earlier in my life but this one was probably is probably the most influential one in uh, nearly 43 years of life and I say this because in a couple of days I will be actually 43 and uh, I'm working on a big project right now. Mike, Shana, I'm working on a big project right now. And uh, some little idea came to the very, very back of my head, which I can't figure out what it is yet. But do watch out for what hap what's happening with me on my wall, on my timeline, on, on Facebook. And, uh, and a new page I just launched and stay tuned because more is coming within this page and more and further. For the moment, I'm going to enjoy my lovely parents and grateful for them for obviously having literally made me. Okay, uh, line in the sand moment for you is... Dot, 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 question mark. Feel free to, to comment if you're comfortable. Alexia, hello. Feel free to comment if you're comfortable. Feel free to message me if you're more comfortable like that. Um, ask me questions. I do I do other videos about ask me anything and stuff. So like suggest topics, whatever the case, just go ahead. All right, write, um, comment, ask. Like, think nice thoughts, spread the love, be safe, uh, take care of each other. I see you in tomorrow's video, which is about what to do if you don't have a djembe. Hmm, that's curious. Ciao.